Hi, this is Walford Kaufman bringing you another devotion. This is some troublesome times that we're living in. Just think of this world of ours. Think of America, that we're able to send two men back into space, but we can't get along as we walk upon this earth. The troubles and trials that we're going through, what is happening? The prejudice, the, the racism, the, all this judgment that we have against other people. We need to look at God's Word and what it has to say to us. It says there in James 2, verse 1, My brothers, as believers in our Lord Jesus Christ, don't show favoritism. Suppose a man comes into your meeting wearing a gold ring and fine clothes, and a poor man in shabby clothes also comes in. If you show special attention to the man wearing fine clothes and say, here's a good seat for you, but say to the poor man, you stand there or sit on the floor by my feet, have you not discriminated among yourselves and become judges with evil thoughts? Isn't that what's happening in our world today? We're judging everyone. The young is judging the old. The old is judging the young. Men is judging women. Women judging men. I mean, it doesn't matter the color. It doesn't matter nationality. It would seem like we're attacking everybody. Uh, and the rioters. Now, I believe people have the right to protest. What was done to that man was not right. That officer should not have taken that man's life in such a cruel, uh, inhuman way. There, we need to protest, but not riots. And look how many people, innocent people being hurt, businesses being destroyed. But how many lives have been destroyed through the years because of our favoritism? But you know, I really believe the whole key to this scripture Starting in those very first words, it says, My brothers, as believers in our Lord Jesus Christ, don't show favoritism. This is saying that believers, but how many people are out there today are truly believers in Jesus Christ? We, the church, we as believers in Jesus, have we done what we should? First is we need to love our brothers and sisters, no matter the color, no matter, no matter nationality, no matter the gender. We need to be able to love each other in Christ. But the thing is, have we shared the good news of Jesus Christ with this lost world? Are we really getting the message out? I mean, rioting in the streets, how many of those folks trust Jesus Christ as their Lord and Savior? We've got a message to do. Yes, we need to make sure none of this happened, like what happened with that police officer and that gentleman in, in Minneapolis. We don't want that to happen again. But we need to make sure that Jesus gets in the hearts of all these folks and that they learn how to live a life loving and caring for each other. Store owners, doesn't matter the color. Uh, just think of others, that, uh, police officers, does it matter the color? We need to be loving on each other, forgiving. Do not show favoritism. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, teach us. It's going to be us as believers to get the message out. Lord, rioting is going to continue on when people do not trust you. People do not love you. People maybe that don't even know you. So Lord, we have a mission Yes, we still need to go to foreign countries, but we need to go to the streets of America and share the good news of Jesus Christ that changes lives and that we truly learn how to live as brothers and sisters in Christ. In Jesus' name, amen. Pray for our country. Pray for our nation. Pray for every, every citizen out there. And remember, pray for our law enforcement too.